Hello students, welcome back to practice maths. Today in this video, we are going to find the solutions of integration. That is chapter uh, integration 6 uh, chapter and 60 solutions here. We are going to find the solution in this section 2. Uh, this is very very important chapter. I told you already. Please practice here more and uh, by heart formulas also. I will start with the section 2 first question here. Now second question first uh, given that evaluate the following integrals. He is saying that. So first question is given that integral under root of 1 plus 3x minus x square is given here so first what we have to do means we have to evaluate this one as a like sequence form so please don't panic while watching the question so search for the solutions only okay so here uh, what we have to do here the so solution here integral under root of so I will do one thing 1 minus x square plus 3x I will write okay so after that I will do one thing here so first this is equal to here so integral under root of so integral dx also is there now so here dx will be there okay so it will be dx i will come on minus from these two terms here okay x square minus 3x will come here like this into dx okay and after that i will do something here integral under root of 1 minus x square minus 3x see here so x square minus 3x 3 into x into x like like if we add any one to like any equation to it will become here to uh, like 6x like this uh, like a plus b whole square form like that it will come here a plus b or a minus b whole square form so that type of uh, form we have to bring this one so here i will add uh, some like 3 3 and 9 9 by 4 i will add because here 3 by like 3 uh, three by 2 will come here into 2 will be there okay so this 3 by 2 or minus 9 by uh, 4 I will add here so 2 2 will get cancelled now 3 will remain so this 3 3 by 2 I will add in the whole square form like this 3 by 2 whole square this is 3 by 2 whole square I will add so here I will add in this plus 3 by 2 whole square if I add this one though, it will come like that. Okay, here 2, 2 will get cancelled. That will remain minus 3 by 2 whole square again. So this is plus, by, plus 3 by 2 uh, whole square minus 3 by 2 whole square will get cancelled. Now this form I am writing that like that only. So, okay, so into dx. So here total multiply. So in this form integral under root of 1 minus. So it will become uh, x minus 3 by 2 whole square will come here. One thing okay from this so this one okay so after that part will remain here minus 3 by 2 whole square will remain into dx into dx so integral uh, if i multiply with this uh, minus term so it will become what will come here here under root of 1 will be there and minus here minus into minus plus so plus uh, 9 by 4 will there so this one here this minus will become plus here and it will become 1 plus 9 by 4 so this minus uh, x minus 3 by 2 whole square will be there okay into dx so i will write here again okay in this form so step by step i am doing for you only so because your many comments are there like please do slowly and explain every part some people do, uh, some people saying that please explain fastly and quickly so i am telling uh, in a neat way to understand every part okay every single step so here 9 4 plus 1 4 4 4 into 1 4 plus 3 plus 9 13 so 13 by 4 will come here under root of so minus what will come x minus 3 by 2 whole square will come into dx so we can write this as like under root of uh, what we can write it as under root of 13 divided by 2 whole square we can write it as total no, no to not total only just 13 root here minus x minus mm, 3 by 2 whole square dx will come here so some par formula here that formula we apply here then we will get the answer here so this is a this is b we'll think that though so under root of a square minus x square dx is equal to one formula is there okay that formula in your textbook you will find out this one under root of a square minus x square dx is equal to 1 by 2 into x into under root of a square minus x square okay plus uh, a square by 2 into sine inverse of what is that sine inverse of x by 2 
okay plus c so this is the formula uh, it the question like this way this way only so that we have to do here that we have to bring here so a in the form like root 3 by root 13 by 2 will be there and x is equal to x minus 3 x minus 3 by 2 will be there okay so we'll submit in this one so it will become 1 by 2 into x is equal to how much here so tell me x is equal to x minus 3 will come here x minus 3 by 2 will come here this will come here under root of a square minus x square is here what is that a square minus x square this total only na so this total only will write here under root of 13 divided by 2 whole square minus x minus 3 by 2 okay so plus a square a square is equal to how much a what is this a under root of 13 divided by 2 whole square okay by 2 will come sin inverse of this x by 2 i will write here x is equal to x minus 3 by 2 divided by 2 will come here and plus c so it will become 1 by 2 into x minus uh, 3 by 2 will be will write like that only it will become this 2 to will get cancel it will become 4 13 by 4 minus x minus 3 by 2 will be there okay after that plus this 13 whole square is there root 13 square root will get cancel it will become 13 by 4 will come and again this 2 will be there na this 2 again in this 2 only so 4 to the 8 this 2 will come here sin inverse of so this total will be there again okay so sin inverse of uh, 2x minus 3 divided by 4 will become here plus c so 2 to the this 2 into x 2x here okay after that this 3 2x minus 3 and this 2 divided by 2 4 will come here so this is the answer of this question okay so now moving to the next question this is only the solution for this question uh, now moving to the second question that is also very important now second question is given that here second question integral 9 cos x minus sin x divided by 4 sin x plus cos x 5 cos x dx integral what is given here 9 cos x minus sin x divided by 4 sin x plus 5 cos x is given here into dx so in this okay in this i will convert the numerator into like denominator form okay like denominator form so see how well we convert here uh, how many cos x are phi cos x i will write this uh, this 9 cos x as 4 cos x plus phi cos x here numerator form okay after that minus sin x is there na so i will like that only so de derived by 4 sin x plus 5 cos x okay this step i divided this is a 9 cos x okay please understand okay now here what we have to get again 4 sin x we have to get here so 4 sin x is not there na no? so we will write 4 sin x how we will write so 4 cos x plus 5 cos x minus here i will write 5 sin x minus 5 sin x okay plus 4 cos x Plus four sine x also. Sorry, this four sine x I have to uh, bring in the numerator. So if I uh, subtract these two things, so minus five sine x plus four sine x. So it will give size a minus sine x. That's why I am writing this step here. Okay, please understand. So now divided by so what is divided by four sine x plus five cos x will be there. Okay, now I am writing step by step. Please understand the art. Okay, so integral. So what we have need here? So phi x, phi cos x plus four sine x. Four sine x is there, na? Four sine x plus phi cos x. These two terms I will write one place. Four sine x plus phi cos x. Here four cos x minus phi sine x remaining term. This one. Okay, here I am writing. So divided by total will come as four sine x plus phi cos x dx will be come here. Now here what we have to do here so is equal to integral. Uh, I will separate these two terms like these two terms. Okay na? So uh, if I separate these two terms, so it will become four sine x plus phi cos x will come here and divided by under root of like now four sine x plus Phi cos x will come here and into dx and plus again so these two terms now which one this one and this one so it will become four uh, cos x minus phi sin x divided by what will come four sin x plus phi cos x 
and a dx so this is also integral i have separated so it will get cancel here integral dx will remain here plus integral so this will become integral total 4 cos x minus 5 sin x divided by 4 sin x plus 5 cos x and a dx will come there so it will become integral uh, d integral only dx is equal to how much will come here x will come here and plus this uh, uh, integral will become uh, log of so what will come here 4 sin x plus 5 cos x will come here so this is the end of this question again plus c will be remain here so sir how this will come uh, please tell us how to do this one polytho. so please do one thing here uh, what I can say here d by dx of log of uh, like this log of 4 sin x plus 5 cos x you will do once you will do one though it will become so this will come here okay na? this total divided is come so please do this one uh, if you know integrals uh, so sorry derivatives it will also will come here so I am explaining slow and uh, like every step please concentration everything okay na? thank you and going, going to the next question okay so here fifth question is given that integral under uh, sorry integral so solution here I will write here so integral under uh, sorry integral 1 by 3x square plus x plus 1 he is given here into dx so is equal to so what we can write it as uh, any ideas uh, 3x square then uh, first we have to take it is in the form of like uh, x square plus something like I will come on 3 from these terms it will become 1 by 3 integral uh, 1 by x square plus x by 3 plus 1 by 3 will come here 1 by 3 so I will add here in the denominator 1 by 3 integral 1 by x square plus x by 3 plus 1 by 3 minus I will add 1 by 36 minus 1 by 36 plus 1 by 36 so this 1 by 36 plus 1 by 36 will get cancel will remain that uh, like same only so 1 by 3 so integral here 1 by this x square uh, x minus 3 sorry x by 3 this uh, what we can take this plus r minus so whichever we see so this one is here we'll take that one so x x plus uh, what can we can write 1 by 6 whole square we can write so this and this and this term so see how I'll read, uh, how we can write that one will okay x plus 1 by 6 whole square is equal to what will come x square plus uh, 2 into 1 by 6 into x okay plus 1 by 36 will come 2 1 ja, 2 3 ja. means 3 by x will be there now so this 3 by x sorry x by 3 so that's I'm taking here okay na? after that plus 1 by 3 will remain there and minus 1 by 36 will be there in the denominator okay so I will write from here okay from the left side 1 by uh, sorry 1 by only root only 3 integral so 1 by uh, this x plus 1 by 6 whole square will write like that only so it will become LCM is how much will come here 36 will come so here numerator 12 will come will multiply to 12 by uh, 36 minus uh, 1 will come here so this here 12 will come okay LCM is 36 will come 3 12 ja, so 36 no 36 this 12 will multiply here so that will come now after that it will it will become 1 by 3 into integral of 1 by x plus 1 by 6 whole square will come minus this will become 11 by 36 will come here okay 11 by 36 will come so for that I will do one thing here uh, under root of 11 divided by 6 whole square I will write 6 whole square I will write in the denominator I am writing I am saying that in the denominator so we will write like that only so this is a like uh, uh, what we can say into dx is there na? so sorry I am writing I am forgetting this one dx 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 so if uh, in this what we can say this is a formula of uh, a square sorry x square minus a square okay x square minus a square so that's formula I will write here here again one thing so this is uh, 36 no here plus will come here I forgot this one okay this will become x square plus a square 1 by X, x square plus a square is equal to uh, I will write the here formula okay 1 by uh, a square plus x square or x square plus a square 
dx integral okay so this we can write it as uh, 1 by a into tan inverse of tan inverse of what we can write x by a na? so x by a plus c okay so this we can write so I'm, I, I will convert this uh, total formula in, uh, this problem into that formula it equal to 1 by root 3, 1 by 3 into uh, what will get 1 by a so 1 by a means here how much okay root 11 by 6 so 1 by root 11 by 6 okay into tan inverse of into tan inverse of so what will again, again x by a no x is equal to how much here x plus 1 by 6 no x plus 1 by 6 divided by under root of 11 by 6 will come here this plus c so if you want right answer i will write here please uh, don't mind i'm writing total answer here so 1 by 3 will remain like that only here so 6 will come upside okay uh, into 6 by root 11 will come okay 6 by right uh, into tan inverse of this 6 will come 6 6 will get cancelled 6x plus 1 divided by uh, root 11 will come here and plus c so 3 1 ja, 3 2 ja also will come so total answer will come like this so this is the end of the fifth question here now sixth question is given that integral dy dx divided by under root of 5 minus 2x square plus 4 is given huh? here solution so integral dx divided by uh, so what is given here minus 2x is in huh? I will come and minus 2 from these total things total thing here it will become uh, I, I will write it as x square plus 4 by sorry minus 4 by 2 means uh, what will come this is 4x uh, uh, 4x 4x by 2 will come here plus uh, minus only no? so minus uh, 5 by 2 will come here so 2 1 2 2 will get cancelled here will come that one so integral dx divided by under root of minus 2 into x square minus 2x okay minus 2x here minus 5 by 2 will come here so in this under integral dy dx of sorry dx divided by under root of minus 2 into so i will add here x square minus 2x plus 1 and minus 1 i will add, add here okay minus 1 minus 5 by 2 so it will become integral dx divided by minus 2 into under root of x minus 1 whole square so x minus 1 whole square this is minus uh, 1 the minus 2 in, inside only no so it will become integral uh, will go there and it will become minus 1 minus 1 mm, here minus 1 minus 5 by 2 will remain here so after that here so what we can do here so is equal to integral dx divided by minus 2 under root of minus 2 into x minus 1 whole square minus 7 by 2 so this is 2 1 ja 2 minus 7 by 2 will come here ok 7 by 2 will come and after that uh, what we can do here mm. Okay, this minus two I will multiply with this equation because uh, my in the under root uh, we can we can we can't bring out this two without like uh, with minus two. That's why I, I will multiply this one with the minus. So integral dx divided by under root of two into okay seven by two my min minus x minus one whole square will come here. Okay, so this I will do here. I will bring one by two outside, so it will become integral dx divided by. So here what will be there? Uh, under root of 7 by 2 7 by 2 whole square minus x minus 1 whole square will come here so this will come so this 7 by 2 under root whole square I am writing here only 7 by 2 okay root 2 will get cancelled now so that's why it will I am writing here here again one formula will come that is integral 1 by uh, this is a square na, under root of so sorry I forgot this under root of okay I forgot under root of a square minus x square dx is equal to we can write it as sine inverse of sine uh, inverse of x by a plus c we can write is this formula here we have to introduce so it will become 1 by root 2 into uh, so if we write this one too it will become sine inverse of sine inverse of x by a x is equal to how much x minus 1 
divided by a is equal to how much root 7 by 2 no so root 7 by 2 so this is plus c here so if you want to modify anything you can modify like here 1 by root 2 into uh, sine inverse of so this root 2 will go subside it will become root 2 into x minus 1 divided by root 7 plus c will come here so this is end of the sixth question uh, now moving to the next question so now dear students this is the fifth fourth one it's a very very important uh, something difficult not difficult so 50 50 okay so it is very very important please practice okay so 1 by 1 plus sin x plus cos x is given into dx is given here i will write sin x is equal to okay sin x is equal to 2 tan okay x by 2 divided by so 1 plus tan square x by 2 i will write and again cos x is equal to i will write 1 minus tan square x by 2 and divided by 1 plus tan square x by 2 i will write here these two terms i will introduce in this one okay i will substitute in this one now solution will become here will come like this integral 1 by 1 plus so sin x is equal to how much 2 tan x by 2 divided by 1 plus tan square x by 2 will come here again what is there cos x is there now cos x is also i will write it as 1 minus tan square x by 2 divided by 1 plus tan square x by 2 will come here so into dx please guys go through your examples you will find there this type of question okay i already saw those questions and uh, i'm i practiced here and i'm telling you that this is in the process of that one okay now here uh, what we can do here integral so one so one into leg dx is equal to dx i will write here directly divided divided by so in this lcm is this one plus tan x tan square x by 2 same will come here in the denominator so it will become this one by two here we multiply one plus tan square x by two so one plus tan square x by two in the place of 1 okay now denominator total will come like that and after that plus 2 tan square tan x by 2 plus 1 minus tan x tan square x by 2 total divided by uh, this 1 plus tan square x by 2 will come tan square x by 2 will come so here uh, what will there so plus tan square x minus tan square x by 2 will get cancelled here okay this total will come to the numerator okay numerator so 1 plus tan square x by 2 integral divided by 1 plus 2 tan x by 2 will come 1 by 1 plus 2 tan x by 2 will come here okay see here my dear students here 1 is there now so again 1 is there now 1 plus 1 will become denominator 2 will come here okay 2 plus 2 tan x by 2 will come so here 1 plus tan tan square x by 2 we can write it as what okay what we can write it as uh, like secant square x theta okay secant square x by 2 secant square x by 2 will we can write it as divided by 2 plus tan 2 tan uh, x by 2 will come here so this is a question we solved here i will take uh, here uh, some important uh, thing that so t is equal to tan x by 2 i will take here t is equal to dt is equal to how much uh, tan theta is equal to what what is the formula like tan theta will d2 it will become uh, this x in the x plus 1 uh, secant square x by secant square x by 2 will come so in the x plus x by 2 is n into 1 by 2 will come here into 1 by 2 will come so into dx so this i will submit in this one secant square one way like will submit so it will become in the question in this way i'm submit in this in the i'm so in this solution i'm submitting here uh, secant square uh, x by 2 no secant square x by 2 dx is equal to dt so 2 into dt so 2 into dt divided by 2 into sorry 2 plus 2t will come in the t this is tan x by 2 plus t will come so integral so it will become in the from this 2 i will come on here integral uh, 2 into dt by okay 2 will come on to 1 plus 2t will come so this 2 2 will get cancel here integral dt divided by 1 plus 2t will come here 1 plus 2t hurry yaar sorry yaar here plus 2 also will come on now so i forgot that one so sorry so 1 plus t only will there 
so 1 plus t means here uh, what we can say integral dt by dt is equal to log t na uh, log t only yes log of 1 plus t will come plus c so here log of 1 plus t is equal to what we what we took tan x by 2 no so tan of x by 2 plus c so this is of answer of fourth question fourth one so now ending this one like uh, third question is there now this third question please go through your uh, like a uh, class here in a college class work class work like that so please ask your for, uh, faculties like uh, lecturers so please provide them with this answer this is very very important uh, please ask them uh, to provide this question solution i will uh, otherwise i will tell you this is uh, in the next video because uh, it is take lot of time i will do these questions for you so how